Members of Renewed Hope family in River State, led by Tony Okocha from the 23 local government areas in the state, held a solidarity work in the major streets of Port Harcourt in support of President Bola Tinubu's policies and the Federal Capital Territory Minister Nyesom Wike. Okocha led the rally, which commenced from the Polo Club in government residential area through the major Abba Road to the government house access and, the, and then terminated at the Port Harcourt Club on Forces Avenue. They carried banners with inscriptions showing their support for President Tinubu. Speaking with journalists during the peaceful march, Okocha urged the people of the state and Nigerians to be patient with President Tinubu, saying that his policies would right the fortunes of the country in due time. And we ask our governors, and we ask our local government chairman, what are they doing with the huge and humongous amount of money that accrues to them, almost if not unprecedented? What have they done? So why is it that it is cynical that it's a problem? A man who has just been on the roster for 14 months, we know that he's a game changer. We know that he knows what to do at the fullness of time. And the president had come down from his high horse to address Nigerians. Some are saying, oh, he should have been punched. He should have been punched. To say this, that is called presidential address. On the hardship movement, Okocha accused Governor Siminolaye Fubara of sponsoring the anti tinubu protests in Rivers, alleging that the governor benefited from the inactivity in the country and in the state. Also speaking, Gift Walu, one of the commissioners that resigned from the cabinet of Fubara during the peak of the political crisis in the state, emphasized that Tinubu should be supported for taking courageous steps to drag Nigeria back on track. We are marching for Mr. President. We want to clean the roads that was typical of August 1st to August 10th. We imagine that in River State, you all know you are from here. River State had never been an epicenter for any protest or demonstration. The man who funded, the man who sponsored, the man who held midnight meetings with the youth, I repeat to call them hoodlums, is the first and the only person that benefited from the 10 days of inactivity in Nigeria, particularly in River State. When other governors in the other states are busy, meeting with all, all manner of people and all strata of people in their, community, in, their, in their states. Our own governor drives freely to attend the burial of uh, somebody's uh, mother. Before now, Nigeria was moving in the wrong direction with a lot of speed. Wrong direction with speed. What president The solidarity work comes barely 24 hours after the River State High Court sacked his caretaker committee of the All Progressive Congress APC in River State. 
Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.